Hello. Hello there, my savvy crew. Yes, it is me. A new, more mature Straw Hat Rod. <laughs> yes, I am mature and full of maturity. <laughs> And, and all that good stuff. And I decided since I'm back to recording videos again at, at variable times, I decided to give you a, a, some various announcements. First, first of all, I'm a Razer streamer now. Yes, I am now sponsored by Razer. Yes, the the, the game, gaming company of choice for the Straw Hat crew. They they are a really nice team to work work with. They are super nice. They're all, always trying to get get you know new streamers out there and, and and help help them not you know and i was one of those one of those people and i, I figured since i've been sponsored by, uh, uh, sponsored by razor that i go ahead and show you the vast array of products that, that i have by Ra razor and, and i can't say what, whether i'm going to do it with, with do it with uh, uh, do a, a video for each product that i have so First thing I'm gonna show off to you guys is the can, the can, the Razer camera you use the Razer Kayo Pro. I think that says Kayo Kayo Cayete Caliente Caliente. However you say it, that's how you say it. So on that discussion, the Razer Kayo Pro, I got it back in December, December, and after extensive t testing and. All that trying it out on different stream, uh, streams and all that, I had to say, it is absolutely worth uh, worth the while because not not o only does it give you give crisp, clean 1080 pixels and, and works with every sh uh, stream uh, streaming setup that you got, but it also uh, adapts to light situations. Now I have a, uh, have a ring like like. like most stream streamers do, but e even if you don't, I'll, I'll even go ahead and turn it off for you guys. <laughs> but even if I, if I turn off, it adjusts to the light that's available in the room. I'll even turn off, turn off my uh, my LEDs. It, it adjusts to even the most the darkest of of situations. Now, uh, now I, even if I'm in complete darkness, it'll even figure its stuff out. Reason why I got the Razer Kyro. Pro Cryo, especially the pro version, is because I needed a camera that was and that was it could go up to 60 fr 60 frames per second, and that's and that's important to me because to have a, a camera that can go up to the same level and quality of videos that I upload, because all my content now will will be 60 frames per, per second at least, if not like really high high quality stuff. I I. And that, that's the reason reason that that I got it. So uh, so, so any, anyway, you're probably wondering, you know, what's the difference? Well, firstly, here, here are two two um, two um, compa comparing photos. The and I want now now the photo on the right. That's my old camera. That's a Uzimo um, thir uh, 30 FPS uh, Ultra HD and, uh, and all that. And then the one on the right. Uh, the right or the, the the direction I did did not say is the the the, the Kyo Pro, and you can just absolutely see the the, the difference in in full light and, and in, in dark dark situations that the Kyo absolutely out, outperforms it, and it out, outperforms most uh, most cameras on the market. Like the literally the uh, for, in my opinion, in my professional opinion of using it for three, four, four, five, five months is that this is a camera that the only step up from this is to have like an actual cam camcorder and an actual like just a full on, a full on camcorder. This is the best bank, bank for buck. Now, I'm sure you guys are wondering what the, uh, what the price is, price is. And it, in typical, fa in typical fa fashion, it, it, it's it's in a competitive pr price. You know, you're getting a a pro ca camera with 60 FPS and variable, um, t 1080p HDR en enabled and all that for, for 199.99, and that's very competitive to what you see see on the market. It might seem a little high, but trust me when I say like 
I know with Razer products, they t tend to seem like a little higher price, but they are absolutely worth it. Again, I'll put, I'll put the two the, the two pictures up again. The the difference in quality is n is just night and day. It's it's just there's no comparison and especially for you guys I want to make sure that you're getting the best quality uh, quality out of me. I, I mean because I started on a piece of crap gateway and gateway la la laptop and I'm not talking gateway like it, it was a it was a beginner gateway like the company gateway it was a I, I don't even remember what it was it was absolute garbage and you can you can tell because the camera quality was poor and I want to give you guys the best co uh, possible quality possible and Razer is a a able to do that so if you want want go go ahead and, and go ahead and get it you a absolutely can they they're, they're sure to ha have de deals on all that they, and, and you can get and you can get ha you could get a deal on a, on a on a ring light if you want to it does come with a virtual ring light as well um, it, it, it's I, I think it, it, it's pretty good. It's, and you get a wider f field of view, like, again, showing the two different pictures. In, in the p picture of the, the, the Uzi Mono, you couldn't, you couldn't see the sticker. You, can, you cannot see, see the sticker because it has such a narrow field of view. And, and to me, that's important. That's very, very important. Now, the only down, uh, downside, and again, I, you expect honestly from me, and I'm going to tell you the only... The only downside that I ha have of this is that, and, and, and maybe, and maybe this is just my ineptness, is that I can't, I, 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 I don't, I don't know how to make my my webcam picture be a square, be a square rather than a rectangle. That's my only complaint about that. Other than that, absolutely, absolutely amazing. Now. I've already decided I'm going to go ahead and do two products per, per video. So you just saw the camera, the amazing camera. Now let's say you're, 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 you're say you're wanting something to really bring your gaming up to ne ne next level. You want to bring your con uh, console gaming or your controller gaming, or you just want a better controller in, 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 in general. Well, I ha have the product for you. The Razer Wolverine Ultimate. Gaze at the glory of it. Look at that. Isn't it a beautiful baby boy? Or girl, you know. I, controllers can have multiple genders. Um, but but that, that being said, the Razer Wolverine Ultimate. Now, the only reason I, I, I got this is because the piece of crap $15 GameStop special controller that, that I had it broke, you know. It, it broke due to of, of due to a certain situation of rage and all that. And yeah, it, I kind of just yeeted it out the window in, in, into oncoming traffic. Um, don't worry, no one was uh, harmed in that uh, other than, than a cheap cheap ass controller. So, and going off of that, why did I get get this? Because I originally didn't want a pro controller. I didn't want a pro anything because I think I, I feel like when you, you hear like ultimate or something like that it's usually a, usually a price and all that just to tingle your your fa fancies because when when companies use words like that it it it's all bark but but zero buck why except for this I decided to get this because I was like you know what I'm gonna tr treat myself you know it ha ha has has nice little t little toggle switches. It had and toggle switches and all that that come off that you can that you can arrange yourself. It comes with extra, you know. This um, I don't know if you can see it, this this little button button here come, comes off and all and all that. Um, here let me see. It comes off and all that. Yeah, this is going very well. Razor, if you're seeing this, I apologize. <laughs> But the re reason why th this controller is uh, uh, why I love uh, love and I'm happy that I got this controller is because it has all all the buttons you could ever need. It has your, your normal triggers, buttons, and, but then it also has uh, has buttons here and, and down here. So if you're playing a game like Fortnite or something like that, and that I personally prefer to using uh, using my Razer keyboard more 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 than anything thing for a game like Fortnite because it just it feels better for me, but 
if you're if you're if you are that kind of person that uses a controller for a game that that requires lots and lots of buttons, but you you're more, much more comfortable in a controller, this is for you because it, it does have mappable buttons. It does, you can ch choose like what button do you want to want to map to what, where, it, and you you can basically run everything through uh, uh, through your contr controller because it has as a port um, port down here for for your, for your headphones for your, your your head mic combo. It has a mute button. It has a cycle button. It has a button to turn off the and turn off the volume. It, ha it has everything. Of course, it syncs with, with snaps and all that. So you're gonna have this do this do whatever you want, need for it to do. Um, if you want it to be like all fiery and stuff like that, and it's a really really solid control controller. Like it doesn't it doesn't feel it does it feels thought out. That's what I noticed with a lot, a lot of these Razer products is they feel thought out. That you know, an actual gamer, an actual computer user, an actual tech enthusiast. Can really can really get get their money get their money's worth and then some out of it because it's designed with passion, right? Now, here's the thing, thing with the, the Wolverine Ultimate Controller that I really love is that it feels solid. It feels like a solid, actual good controller. Like you you can throw it, you can yeet it, and, and all that, and it's not gonna break. It feels like it was. It feels like it was designed by a by a gamer for uh, for a serious gamer. Like no one would think of uh, no company would think of adding buttons down here. Like I, if I wanted to use this for Fortnite, I can ha have each of the building options like just all, and just along here, and that's awesome. And then another feature that I noticed I really appreciated until I discovered what it was is that. You know how this controller, uh, th this trigger goes down some of the way, and this one goes down all the way. Well, c these switches control that, so this can go, all, uh, and you can s set them individually to your preference. And I discovered that while playing Farming Simulator of all, of all, of all games. It's a fantastic game. I pro promise. I, I just couldn't find anything else. It's a fantastic game if you if you love being stressed by everything all the time without stopping. Um, but when I discovered that, I was like, "This is designed by someone that wants the gamer to be comfortable and and, and to where the only reason you lose a game is because of of how you use use the controller because of the, the, the skills that go behind it." So no, I'm not not saying you're you're, you're a scrub. I'm just just saying to get good, son. So, um, but um, but anyway, yes. The, so now the last question you probably have: How much is it? Well, uh, it's a, uh, not going to be the round one hundred fifty nine ninety nine, and and that is a lot for for controller. I, even I was like, "Whoo, wait a minute, uh, one hundred fifty nine for for controller? That that's a lot." But w once I actually got it, I was like, "Okay, this is absolutely absolutely worth it. This is this is a controller I can absolutely get behind, and I can actually use for for what I'm wanting to do with it." So that that wraps up like the first uh, and the first the first part of my of my razor review. In the second part, I'm gonna do do the 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 new Huntsman Pro Pro and the experience I, I had had with that with the customer service of Razer, and I'm gonna talk about that. And then I'm gonna do do the do the the mouse and the Pro mouse that they have. So that that's all, all for this. I know it's not not one of my usual exciting videos, but. I, I will be uploading on a more reg regular schedule. Anyway, that that's all for now. T take care. And as always, if you, if you like what you see, you know what to do, and I'll see you in the next video.